Question four from paper two of the 2016 National Five for two marks. Factorise fully this expression here. Remember, the first rule of factorisation is take out any common factors first before you start throwing brackets all over the place. So don't just look at the x squared and go, oh, I'll have a bracket there. No, they both divide by 3, so 3 comes out of it, leaving just a little x squared. And then instead of that maybe having confused or annoyed you because it wasn't quite a perfect square, why wasn't that 49, you might have been thinking? Because when you divide it by 3, 3 into 4 goes 1 and 1 over, it becomes 16, which is a nice little perfect square. Now you can put in those brackets you were desperate to put down all along. It must be x times x for x squared, and it must be 4 times 4 for 6. So it'll be minus the 4 plus the 6, or put the signs whichever way you like. There we go.